Hello and welcome to Daily Tech Video. In this video, we will see how to create a bootable USB drive to install OSX Mavericks on your Mac computer. Apple has released OSX 10.9 Mavericks developer preview during the WWDC conference last week. And uh, if you have downloaded from developer portal or from any torrent website, then this tutorial can help you to uh, configure it uh, on your thumb drive and further you can install it uh, easily uh, on your Mac computer. So this will take uh, three to four steps. Each step is a little bit lengthy. Uh, so you can make a pass uh, in the video if you uh, want to follow it uh, step by step. So once you have inserted the pen drive on your Mac computer, launch device utility and then select the pen drive from the list of devices. And then in the right side, you will see uh, a tab called partition. So click on that and select partition one as the partition layout you can change uh, the partition name if you want and then click on apply make sure the format is mac os extended journal step two once you have completed the partition uh, of your usb thumb drive it is time for us to uh, burn the uh, dmg file to uh, the usb thumb drive so in order to do that, uh, navigate to the folder uh, which contains the uh, OS 10.9 Mavericks uh, DMG file. So double click on it. It should open the contents of the DMG file. So there you can see uh, only the folder named packages. There are other files uh, which are actually hidden uh, along with this uh, content as a system file. So we have to reveal it first in order to get the another DMG file which has uh, the setup and other uh, portable disk uh, properties. So you can do that easily by launching the terminal and running this command and make sure this parameter set to true to reveal all the files on, on the finder window. So here you can see the base system.dmg. So this is what the file we actually need to burn uh, to the pen drive initially. So this folder contains few set of files, few package files, which we will be copying it later. So right click and copy this folder and paste it wherever you want. I'm moving this base system.dmg file to the desktop, which is uh, 469.3 MB. Step 3. Double click the base system.dmg file to check whether all the contents are there. You can see the setup file and all other default files that you need to uh, proceed with installation of Mac OS X 10.9 Mavericks. Now navigate to disk utility and then click on base system.dmg, click on restore. Now in the destination, select the pen drives location as the destination. So the source must be the base system.dmg and the destination must be the OSX, uh, whatever the name you have assigned to the pen drive uh, partition. So click on restore to complete the restore process where all the contents of the base system.dmg will be moved to uh, uh, the pen drive. Step four. Once the restore process completed, go back to the pen drive to verify all the contents and then navigate back to uh, the DMG file which you have mounted uh, in the step 2. So this was the only folder uh, which we were uh, seeing initially and we have used terminal to display the hidden files. So copy this packages folder and go back to the pen drive. Now navigate to system and then installation. Here this is a shortcut file for packages directory which will produce error if you double click on it. So delete that file and paste the folder packages. So the size of the packages folder is 4.49 GB. So it must be taking quite some time. Step 5. Go back to terminal and Execute the command with a little change in the parameter. Let us change this true to false. 
files revealed. To hide the files, uh, system files which you have uh, actually revealed with the true command. For step by step instruction, you can visit imacify.com. I have also added the link of this uh, full tutorial to create a bootable USB drive uh, in the description below. Thanks for watching. Have a wonderful day.